You might not know, but I was an advocate for law firm partnership. These firms were all admitted to the Ministry of Justice. Seeing these firms continue to develop and prosper makes me very happy. I am Ambrose Lam, a member of the Legislative Council of Hong Kong. I am a Hong Konger and have served as a lawyer for about 36 years. I love my job. I used to be the president of the Law Society of Hong Kong and have served as an arbitrator in many arbitration centers. Hong Kong lawyers are familiar with the common law systems of both China and the West. When we start discussing legal matters, we can quickly identify whether a local lawyer is professional. For mainland companies looking to go global, they can bring Hong Kong lawyers with them. Of course, we will keep improving our skills. I was invited to be a member of the Consultative Committee on Guangdong Hong Kong Cooperation of Nansha, and that was the first time I got to know Nansha. The Chinese mainland's legal system is not based on common law, which is the significant advantage to Hong Kong lawyers. Mainland companies and their lawyers are not familiar with common law jurisdictions implemented in countries such as Australia, the United Kingdom, the United States, Malaysia, and Singapore, whereas Hong Kong lawyers understand these jurisdictions well. Hong Kong lawyers can help clients choose the appropriate legal strategies when they want to invest or protect their interests in these common law areas. Therefore, Hong Kong lawyers, together with mainland lawyers, can play a significant role in this aspect. By working together, we can help mainland companies go global. Since I joined the consultative committee, I have visited Nansha many times. I also led a few Hong Kong legal professional bodies, such as the Hong Kong Bar Association the Law Society of Hong Kong, and representatives from several legal organizations, to visit Nansha. I feel welcomed in Nansha. Each government department has treated us like family. Over the past few years, every time when I came here, it felt like home to me. After these visits, everyone has been very positive about the cooperation. Working with mainland lawyers, we feel confident about the future. During our discussions, we found that the major concern could be how to curb inter-regional legal conflicts and meld the rules of Guangdong and Hong Kong. Everyone needs to know and understand what the rules are. Since there are differences, finding a solution or mechanism is crucial. In this way, we can have better cooperation and help our companies venture into international markets. By understanding and bridging the different legal systems, Hong Kong and mainland lawyers can create a more cohesive framework that supports mainland companies as they expand globally. This cooperation ensures that businesses can navigate the complexities of international law more effectively, leading to more successful global ventures. The incubation center in Nansha is very effective in advancing the judicial system here. It provides a one-stop service for legal matters, including law firms, courts, and Nansha International Arbitration Center, creating a comprehensive place for legal communication and collaboration. Because of the hard work over the past few years, Hong Kong law firms have been encouraged to cooperate with law firms in Guangdong province, forming law firm partnership to provide legal services. The GBA legal professional examination is well known, and through our platform, many Hong Kong lawyers taking this exam have learned about the development of Nansha, making them particularly eager to go there, looking for law firms, and working as lawyers. Our platform will significantly increase the number of law firms in Nansha, fostering more communication and cooperation with Hong Kong lawyers. I believe this is a major contribution of our consultative committee. My greatest pleasure is seeing the rapid development of the legal community in Nansha. There is increasing cooperation with Hong Kong, and many Hong Kong lawyers are now employed on a temporary basis, establishing more law firm partnership there. Although the mainland of China and Hong Kong have different legal systems, it is still one country with two different jurisdictions. Therefore, we need to find a way to connect the two systems to better integrate and develop for the country's benefit. This is my biggest wish, to see better communication and cooperation between both places in terms of melding the rules of the mainland and Hong Kong and various fields as soon as possible. By doing so, we can contribute our part to the country's prosperity and its success.